All right, guys, bright and early at the Spanish Bay Inn. Got the Chiron here. This is a demo spec. There's another one running around. I think these are two in the Malibu for test drives a couple months ago. But the main attraction over here, guys, Michael Fuchs is at it again. He just unveiled a brand new Rolls Royce Dawn right over there. Check this color out. Matches his 720S he just got. Fuchsia color. Check out the wheels. Apparently he found a flower petal in this particular color and uh, gave the color sample to Rolls Royce who then recreated this color and it was unveiled yesterday at the quail and these are, these are the results don't know where the 720s is but did a video on that a couple days ago this guy knows what he's doing I like this guy the way he specs his cars how I would spec my cars attention to detail as well the interior is absolutely nuts Michael Fuchs at it again guys I love this guy <laughs> check that out it's the blue BC that was on the Raduno guys boom the early worm gets the leap sorry guys that's really terrible I apologize bright and early check out this chameleon colored Range Rover. I think this is for sale at Meekum. One of a hundred autobiography black editions built. Colors cost spectral amber apparently. There's wine glasses everywhere. Original paint from the factory too. One of a hundred black editions. Damn. What is this? It's crazy. Completing the 70 mile loop. He's going this way. Let's go this way. We got a Chiron behind us, guys. There's a second test one that was spotted in Malibu a few months ago. Adam Bornstein actually did a video with this one, didn't he? And the other one. And the other one, that's right. That video is doing very well. He Maybe he's going to Spanish. No? Maybe. What? Or they're just doing test drives. I don't really know. Let's zoom in and see what's going on. It's not a very nice spot to park your car, lady. There's the Sharon. All right. Alex, are we going to start tallying up how many Sharons we see or what? We've just seen all three that are here in the last half an hour. Well, I mean, like, in general. Oh, the race. We're going to have a Sharon race. Who can spot the most Sharons? There's no time limit. Are we stopping? Are we I going? Or like... Decide. Oh, okay. Oh, we're in comfort mode. Hold on. There we go. We're good, guys. We're good, guys. Oh, he's taking off the Ferrari cover. Yes, there it is, guys. The Ferrari F40 house. You can stop here if you want. No, is that a... Yup. It is a V6 F-Type, guys. Or bright and early. Oh, better wash the door here. We managed to get in front of the Chiron. We're taking a risk here by speeding up a little bit. Parking on the side of the road and hoping to catch it. Yep, there it is. Yes. What an angry truck, bro. It's gone. So it's left the Spanish Bay in. I think it was just dropping someone off. Back at the hotel room for a quick edit session. I gotta catch up on some of my Monterey uh, car videos or I'm gonna be left behind in the dust. Just imported some footage. Got Michael Fuchs' pink color Rolls Royce that he just took delivery of. And I actually wanna talk about a particular subject that I never usually mention. I actually did a quick video of it. You can check it out right here. It's the expense report of my Switzerland trip. And you can see the expenses I spent on transportation, traveling, hotels, food, just everything. And honestly, traveling is not cheap. Bringing you this content costs money. So I've actually partnered with LastPass right over here, guys. So there's plenty of sites, just Instagram, banks, your credit cards, social media. All these sites require different and unique passwords. When I use any password, password manager, I look for two things. One, it's gotta be secure, and two, it's gotta be very easy to use. I mean, the last thing you really need is like an inefficient password manager. So you can basically download LastPass on your laptop, desktop, phone, Apple Watch, and I've actually installed it as a 
Chrome extension on my laptop here. You can see my Chrome extension right up here. So you just click on it, boom, open my vault, and you can enter any password right here by adding site, entering information, you save it, and that's it. You're ready to roll, guys. And instead of writing all your passwords on like a notepad or a Word document, LastPass will keep track of them. So now you're thinking security and exactly how secure is it? And once you set the master password, it's encrypted locally on your laptop or computer. And that encrypted data is then sent to LastPass. And the level of encryption that they use is state of the art. And it would basically take someone an entire lifetime to manually decrypt. All right, guys, that's basically LastPass. Check it out. It's super secure, easy to use, and it's super efficient. So you guys want to save some time, check it out. But as for now, I'm gonna continue finishing this vlog and uh, we'll see what we see when we go back out there. I'm sorry, but a couple of BCs just showed up on 17 Mile. So the editing, it's gotta be put on hold. We gotta roll, we gotta leave guys, let's go. We finished the uh, Bugatti Chiron display over there. Yeah. You too. Cheers, mate. Got the matching old school Bugatti with Hezzy's new Chiron. The question is, yeah, the old one doesn't have the yellow wheels, so, hmm, it's a bit odd. Now we're both BCs out here, quite the crowd. Both pieces are out. Quite the crowd, guys. Jesus. Mm. Well, quite the crowd here, guys, on 70 Mile, and Stratman has arrived with a vlog camera. Oh, he's got a fan already. What is this? Oh. Head out. Got four Paganis here. Yep, all the eggs are there. RSR, Regera. Nice. I was doing that. Wow, they're full. That. Um, we are not going there. What is happening here? So that's how they put the cones out. <laughs> hmm. Trying to fall over, Jesus. Oh, Bayron. <laughs> Currently on the side of 17 Mile Drive again. We've been trying to leave for the past three to four hours, but cars keep showing up, and we're supposed to be seeing the Koenigseggs roll through, but it's been 30 minutes, nothing's rolled through yet, guys. So we're just gonna edit today's video on top of the M4, right next to the SL here, guys. All right, we just arrived. We've been driving past this house for the past three or four days, and I actually haven't had time to check it out, but before you even enter the house, everyone needs to check out the sign. Hold on, just wait for it. This is a private collection. If you're going to post pictures, please write the following. Beverly Hills Motoring Estate in Pebble Beach. Please take a picture of this so you don't forget. Um, okay, Gordon. Albeit it is a very nice collection of cars here, all lined up. Now the question is, are these actually for sale? I think they are, huh? I won't bore you with the details. I'll just do a quick walk around. I'm not gonna talk about each car and the specifications, but Black Enzo, P1 GTR, 300 SL, F40, TDF, the green. AMG GTR right down there. Perfect timing. House is really nice. Look at that. This is driving around earlier as well. There's a yellow Enzo in the back. Let's take a quick look. Oh, there's a couple of 300 SLs here too. <laughs> 
Compton Chris's ATSV here. Woo! He's got the whole crew behind us. I've been kicked out of both my cars, guys. What the fruit? <laughs> All right, guys, we just checked in the Hyatt. Wouldn't even believe the lady next to me was complaining that her room's balcony was too far from, I don't know where she wanted to stay, but she was throwing a complete pissy fit. My goodness, we gotta get out of here. We're good. Our room is right over there. Okay. Dude, some lady next to me was throwing like the biggest fucking fit ever. And they're like, like we can't. And you're like, no, it's like, we can't. She's like, it was like the mom too. 